My name's Charles Lewis. I've been a CFI now for almost four years and got about 2,000 hours of tail wheel instruction behind me and primarily cubs and other tail draggers. Michael Day and myself got together and we decided that it'd be a great time to have some people get together and learn how to shorten their takeoff and landings, which is what STOL stands for. Both of us enjoy being a bush pilot to some degree and it was a lot of fun. We actually got about 15 folks together and met on Friday night, had supper, then had a little class, if you will, ground school. We talked about the techniques and how to do a better job of short field takeoff and landings. After a Friday night, we got together on Saturday morning and started implementing those techniques. Right out here on the field, we learned how to shorten our takeoffs, shorten our landings, and stay within the confines of what safety would allow. We went off to about 15 different strips with different varying levels of difficulty. Some were narrow, some were short, some were uphill, some were downhill. We did a lot of that work and had a great time. When we got back that afternoon, we sort of checked the scores, if you will, and we saw that most people had about a 25% decrease in their takeoff and their landing distances, which is great. And some people say, well, what's the big deal? It's a big safety factor. If you were to have an engine out somewhere in any type of aircraft, be a Cub or a 172 or a Bonanza, if you can learn how to shorten your landing up, you've got a better chance of making an all-field landing and surviving. If you've got interest in being a bush pilot or shortening up your takeoff and landings, give me a call sometimes. That's what South Oaks Aerodrome's all about. <laughs>